right, so tell me a little bit about the Tularosa Little League baseball and t-ball. We used to have a league. We used to be chartered with National Little League. There was just not enough interest from parents to help run it. And so the people who were running it, you know, their kids kind of aged out. And so our kids are now coming up. And we wanted to go ahead and get that going again because it's a very good thing for the community of Tularosa to have, you know, Little League sports where all of the kids have access to it. Last year, we chartered with Alamogordo like we played in Alamogordo on teams, but we were having to come to Alamogordo for games. It also limits the amount of kids our community can send to the All-Stars, so that's like the All-Star tournament. And so we came together, a few of us, and decided we wanted to get that back for the kids so that we could send actual teams, full teams, to All-Stars, but also kind of prepare them for middle school, high school. So anyway, we kind of just got together and did that. I've got a board set. We had a meeting last week. We will be taking sign-ups to the end of February. I have a few posted that I'm going to be in Tularosa at the Little League field, and we'll start practicing in March. And then the Little League here in Alamogordo will be, like, interleaguing with us. So we're going to bring our teams here, and they'll bring their teams to Tularosa to play us. We also have some interest in Mescalero. So we're going to have... Mescalero and Tularosa come play Alamogordo and vice versa. So I think it's going to be a really good thing for the kids to have that as an option to do because, like I said, a lot of kids were limited because we were having to come to Alamo to play and some people don't have rides. You know, there's there's a lot of things where you can't consistently get rides to Alamo. And so, yeah, we're just trying to bring that back to Tule. I think it's a very important thing to do. Plus, kids, when they're playing a team sport, especially one like baseball, where you learn that you cannot do it on yourself. You learn you have to have teamwork and share responsibility in order to uh, obtain a- any sort of goal. So I think it's a wonderful yeah. thing that you're doing, bringing this back and, to Tule. And discipline, you know, you got to show up for your team and learn to work as a team. And I think it's going to be really good. Our family is very sports oriented, so I think it's going to be a really good thing for the community. Okay, on this thing here, you're talking about you're needing some sponsorships. Tell me about yes. that. So obviously, um, the league hasn't been active in a, a couple of years, so we're needing equipment. There's a fee we have to pay to be part of the Little, little League Association, and then we have to pay for insurance. Obviously, there's going to be some filled up keep other equipment for like the bases, chalk, you know, just the miscellaneous stuff that you don't really think about. We also have to split fees for umpires, so we are looking for sponsors to kind of help get that rolling. We're going to have banners in the outfield for those who donate. I'm kind of throwing around the idea about putting the larger sponsors on the back of our jerseys. But, yeah, any any kind of contribution we appreciate. We're also accepting stuff for, like, our concession stand because we're going to try and have a concession stand there on site. And I think that'll be a good avenue to also raise some money for the kids, especially if we can get some donations. So, yeah, and then, obviously, we're going to be sending teams to All-Stars, so there's going to be cost incurred when we get to that point also. So, um, yeah, we're looking for any kind of sponsors. We don't care, large, small anything else. Is there anything else you want to share with us about the reformed Tularosa Little League baseball and t-ball? Just come out and support if you can once we get a schedule going. Nothing better than the kids having some people show up and cheer for them. Any kind of sponsors or volunteers that are out there that are interested, just maybe give us a shout and somebody will come by. We'll have some kids come by and visit and see what we can do. All right, and how does someone get some more information or get in touch with you folks? We do have a... uh, Email, it's Tularosa Little League Baseball at gmail.com. You could also call myself, Casey Otero, 575-430-1563. And we also have a Facebook page set up, and I post our board of directors information and stuff on there. So we do have a Facebook set up. You can go on there and check that out. I post pretty much all of our updates on there. Fantastic. All right, Casey, thank you so much for spending some time with us. The Tularosa Little League Baseball and T-Ball, I think it's a wonderful thing coming back to the area. Hopefully we have the beginning of many, many seasons to come. Yes, thank you so much.